Hello, and welcome back to some more to Against the Wanderer. On our last episode, we viewed a few events at the Yokai Village and Old Capital of Utsu Ryuji. That was just to break the mold a little bit, because otherwise it would just be more dungeons in the Watatsuki Bunny Line all in a row. Now, speaking on that, whilst we're on that topic, I did do some of them off screen, mainly because I, I did them. I initially recorded them. And a few of them weren't that interesting, like this one was just kind of meh, this one was just kind of a lengthy endeavor with no equipment and whatnot. I mean, I have a feeling you could get equipment, but I never got any. Um, this one was relatively frustrating. Very much in short, you only have talismans. If you don't get flame or thunder talisman, you may as well be stuffed. Um, now, some of the other ones admittedly aren't the most interesting, but I don't know when there's going to be an event. Worse comes to worse, we do a little bit of editing. Because there was no offense last time I did these dungeons either. Else I would have just had it all shown in. But we're going to do the haunted house first. Because I believe that's the only one that allows items, right? Yeah. Of the remainder. It's pretty much similar to one that we've done before. Um, which was the animal one. And we may as well do this one on screen. Because I actually want to show off my upgraded equipment. Because it is pretty good. It's pretty good. It's still the same, obviously, in look. But it's quite substantially stronger. At least I think it is. It should be, it should be. Anyway, a scary, surprising, and funny haunted house is a must for any theme park. Bunnyland is a unique but standard haunted house. And this dungeon goes like enemies will appear in a haunted house. If you're prepared with the right equipment, you'll have no problem with it. Well, we probably won't have a problem with it regardless. I haven't brought that many supplies either because I have a fitness is going to be somewhere to the animal one. The animal lunanet. So we shall see indeed. Because I mostly just want to be done with all these dungeons. Because normally it's a lot easier to include a lot of things because, you know... The main story dungeon normally has like a half, no, two ten bits too, that's what I was going to say. Like for example, with the Yokai Village, we did a bit of dungeon, we went to Yokai Village. And then we did a bit of dungeon, we were at Notori. And then we did a bit of dungeon, and then we're at the boss. And it was a similar format for the old capital area. Or the underground area, let me rephrase that. And I thought that was kind of cool. I do like the different um, feeling of this, but it's just like, yeah. At the same time. Some of the dungeons are just kind of there to me. It's still nice that there's a quantity, though. Then again, my generation was pretty bad, like getting mold deep. <laughs> Red bead cakes on the first floor. Oh, that was pretty horrible. That, that, that was indeed pretty horrible, Tabs. Because in the task one, there was rarely any food for me as well. There could be food, but sometimes it just isn't. Now, I've also got 11 hits on this weapon now, because I decided to just try the seal on this to see if it works. I actually don't know if I can count that, because it goes by so quickly. But yeah, I put my level attack here, I believe. Yeah. I don't know if this stacks. I hope it does. If it doesn't, then we just need to put back on Kokoros. I wish there was a way for me to test it as a present. Because I fear since I've got a lifesteal thing. Well, not even a lifesteal. It's just like, I hit and I heal. Um, well, one could argue that's like steel. But it's the only way for the full thing like vampire. Maybe I could test if I'm missing 11 health, though. Can you, can you do damage to me? No, you don't do damage to me at all. Like, ever. Because of my equipment. Maybe I should have just unequipped something. If only there was healing in the log, then I'd be able to tell whether or not I should put the seal back into Kokoro's weapon. Because I'd hope it would stack. I know I was originally going to keep on her weapon, it's just I put on this so then I can tank a little bit better. Oh, that was a gap trap, that could be bad. <sighs> okay, actually, yeah, can you mic me a few times? Mic me again. No, Kakara! Dang it. I just wanted to lose 11 HP. Ooh. That was unfortunate there. Should be able to speed through this one relatively quick. Why did it me level up? I have no clue. Um, right, so we want to level up Kikoro's equipment a little bit. Well, drink a buff would be nice. Anyhow, so we want to unequip her blade. I didn't find many odds and statues in the place that I grinded. But I had something anyway. So we got plus 59. Oh, that is really good, actually. Because I figured I may as well max this out. The limit was 108, and then I randomly was able to get it to 109. The limit's now 112. It's a bit ridiculous. That's mainly due to one of the seals that they've got in it that increases the limit. I actually want to test to see whether or not you lose your bonuses if you want to equip that seal. Because what I was originally going to do at some point in time is when I get each of these to like say 80 limit, 
and then I just um, unequip the seal. After I get to like over 100, then put on another thing, get that thing to over 100, and try that again. I was going to try that, but that was going to take a while. Oh, that's why this is going to be kind of scary. Okay, so there's half phantoms that possess things. That's how it leveled it up. I wasn't paying full attention. We should be fine, though. There's also Seki Banky heads. Oh, right, this, this is a bit more interesting than the Lunanet because we get to see some of them, like, separate and whatnot. We might be able to get screwed over, though. Who knows? Because before it was just, like, ear types, and that was that. Oh, a new preserve gap. Fine with that. Again, yeah, I'm gonna try and speed through. I'm gonna try and speed through because I don't know whether or not there'll be in a vein. I have wanted to play, play Momiji for a while as well again. Because we've been. Oh, I don't want that. Because we've been Raymond for so long. I've been Mo 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 Momiji a couple of times off screen, however. But it's just like, yeah, why not use it a little bit in the main story? Because after when we finish the main story, assuming it's going to come to a close, because who knows when it will, um, there's always the DLC ones as well, isn't there? Where we play as different characters. Which I'm very much looking forward to. Where I can see him. Yep, but that happened. I was just possessing a bunch of people. Wait, did we all... Oh, I'm... I'm literally just on autopilot, right? How? <laughs> Doing a bunch of dungeons in a row kind of does that to you. It's just like, oh, okay, good to do this. <laughs> Nothing against, of course. She's just been farming quite a bit. Why, wow, but... You know, I actually looked at my playtime on this game as well, and I actually fired a lot more hours than what I saw. I only had like 40 hours or so, and it felt like as if I spent a lot more. But I guess the sheer quantity was just like, oh, hey, you did this. I was just did this. <laughs> Half phantom there. Yeah, so we get a lot of stuff. Like we get Rokankins as well. Another reason to use more Mitra right now as well is to try and stock up on more of her spell cards. Because I don't have many of them because you can't use Fantasy Seal with Momiji. Which is rather unfortunate because if you want to play as Momiji, you pretty much have to farm the spell cards because I've never been able to buy them. Or actually finding tougher things now. I think that's good. I was just kind of skimming over the floors because we've got good enough equipment to tank a lot of things. Do, 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 do. At least for now, I don't know if there's going to be anything substantially more difficult. Like, maybe I'll get one shot by this Yoshika-san. I don't know. I haven't personally tested it. I normally don't speed through these type of dungeons. Do, 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 do. But I'm more interested about the uh, dungeons that have no items. I could have done this off screen. Good off, good off. But I wanted to see whether or not we'll get a vein soon enough. We're just gonna slap all these little ghosties. This ain't spooking me. I ain't afraid of no ghosts. Wait, it's Mandrel Spirits? That was in a boss fight, wasn't it? That was something in the early. The, the first one, right? Well, not, it wasn't even really a. Well, it was a boss fight, it was just scripted. Yeah, the Ronoski one. Was there any other places of Mandrel Spirits? I know you get to talk to them in the old capital, but I don't remember ever getting to fight them. Oh, Trip Trap. That's pretty interesting, though. We get to fight a sheer quantity of varieties of ghosts. Oh my gosh, all these trap traps. Oh, I want the Uncanny Shine. Those are very useful. Uh, what? Because they're very useful for things like pandemoniums and boss fights. Oh, do we use it? Let's just use it. I just love when Meiji's done Maku as well. It's so cool. It's more my style. Oh yeah, you know, uh, I can really try and stuff. It's like, yeah. I, I use fantasy seals and stuff, like goalie balls, but then I let you just cleave you. It's, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool indeed. I don't know. I feel like it's a moment is just a little bit more flashy for me. Never against Rainbow, of course. I really like her as the character. One of my faves, of course. One of my faves. <laughs> I mean, Hexer was flashy enough in Urban Legend and Limbo when I was playing as her. Holy moly. Zip zap zopping all over the shop. Ooh! Pachiko Sen. Let's go. Toasted Waffle. Let's eat that. Why not? That seems like a pretty good dungeon for farming various items, too. Oh, Yuko-sama. 
Well, I ain't afraid of no ghost. Okay, let's see how much this heals. Is that... Well, I got about nine. Let me see. Yeah, I don't think we get 11 hats. So we just get eight. So those don't stack. Okay, stay on our... We've got Big Yuko in our hands. Okay. That's not that worrisome. And then she hit for two. Eh! <laughs> I'm worried about Big Yuko. Uh, did delete no damage. Vengeful Spirit Sun. Wait, there's tears of Vengeful Spirits? What the heck? Okay. Never thought that would have been a thing. Vengeful Spirit Sun. Fun like. Oh, that's a gun. Oh, it's like a banky head. Sam. Yeah, we're gonna have to put that seal back in Kokoro's weapon because it, it looks like it doesn't work. Oh. Yeah, that could actually completely screw you over, like, relatively easily. Now that I think about it, because imagine if you're here, here with, like, suboptimal equipment. Or decent equipment, I'll face that. And then you just get completely wrecked by, like, a Sam or something. Just because there was half phantoms. I gotta definitely understand how this one could be difficult. Mariko is just good enough. Team around, we tackle Big Yuko that came out of nowhere. Although, it could have been something much worse. If it was a big Yoma, I think we would have died. Yeah, I think if it was a big Yoma, we would actually just get, like, one shot. See, like, that, that, that one. They can also decrease their power, so that's probably another reason why. That's just part of her setup. Alright, so, uh, 12th floor. Uh, do 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 Oh, oh yeah. She's not a ghost, is she? <laughs> It's just anything spooky, I suppose. Oh, I just saw there was a Yomu Sama. That might be really scary. Hopefully, she doesn't get me come back. Actually, what's the spell card? Un yeah, if we could farm on Gunny Shines here, that's great. Definitely one of my favorite spell cards to use in this game. It can be a bit of a problem at times, however, but it's mostly helpful. There it was. <gasps> yeah, if that was big, that could have one shot us. Before we were all leveled up, anyhow. Thankfully, the signs aren't that strong, though. Having that heal does help out a lot as well. Lurk is some. No go if they're tough. I haven't really fought many of them. Bit of spirit. Hello. Bye bye. Having Cassinier would be so appropriate. Another Uncanny Shun. Give me that. Um. Do -do -do. Can you even buy Uncanny Shines anywhere? I think you can at times. But not, like, too often. Oh, it's a Jiggle Sama. I do wish Kokoro was a bit more tank here of a character, because I could use her to tank some of them. A little Mole Trap, that's unfortunate. Oh. Wait, do I not have the thing that lets me attack through walls in? I do, right? Meh. Probably just weft the Dan Marku. Maybe I'm just too used to Ramus. Oh, There's a lot of gaps. If only I had a bunch of money, then I'd actually purchase them. I wonder if they could actually possess Mamuzo or something. I've tried several times to be able to, to like, defeat her, and I have not managed it yet. Oh, Kogasa Sam. That's not that scary. I imagine. What's she gonna do? Spook me? Speaking of which, hello, bye bye. Oh. You're a little bit annoying. There we go. Okay, right. 10,000. What the heck? Never had that. Currency used at the Dream and Magic Theme Park, Nazarene Lands. Rumor has it that people burn us to see their feet amidst all the darkness. So. Disneyland? Anyhow. I don't want this. Welp. Oh. Oh, okay, come on, there we go. We're almost done, we're almost done. Oh! Well, that's convenient. Then we just need to go through one more. Pandemonium, that's fine, because since we've got a bunch of these, we could probably just use this in and be done with it. I didn't want to save them, but, I mean, there's that many enemies, so why not just get rid of them all, right? And then just bail. I could check the loot, but... Eh, I've got plenty, I've got plenty. 
clear to any doubts from a parental perspective, that wasn't scary at all. Oh no, because more, most of the Toad characters are cute than scary. Oh, now we have an event! Okay, fine! About dang time! I can't believe I was one off! Ah, convenient! Yeah. Sometimes I get a bit miffed at some of the dungeons, but it's okay! It's a roguelike experience, I can't really blame it. Are you talking on the phone or something or a walkie-talkie? That's what I'm curious about. Oh, that works, yeah. I should forgot they could do that. So you could talk to your little buddy on Earth? PMs! That'd be convenient! Who needs a phone anymore? Well, we already have one, which is Kukoro, but who else? Well, I got to upload somehow. Hmm. <laughs> Why would Rainbow use a computer in the first place? Yeah. How did they even get to the moon? Then again, how did Kokoro get to the moon? Will these questions ever get answered? I'll never know. It's Toho! Welcome to Kinsokyo! <laughs> Wait, is it Koishi? No, 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 that would be like the main character I'd think about, but no, 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 no. I mean, even Utsu forgot about her. She's not in this game we're talking about. Miss Koishi again? And she's gone. Oh, do you say so? Huh? Or was it Kokoro? Yeah, Oh, oh? Oh, it was a Kappa cloaking device! <laughs> I mean, that could have been also a possibility, but. Oh, no, Koishi! Dang it! Dang that, but. Rainbow's experience in yokai extermination. やっぱり君はすごいな。伊達に白霊の巫女をやっているわけじゃないんだね。私はね、余計なごたごたには巻き込まれたくないの。that would be preferable. We try to steal some lunar technology. Oh, 
方がないわねもう騒ぎを起こさないって約束するなら特別に見逃してあげてもいいわ What was she even doing on that PC? For now. No, you wee gold digger. I just love Kakara's background commentary. Technology is magnificent. Wait, we have slot free? Are we the PS2 or something? There were those adapters for the PS2, right? Oh man, it's been so long. I know that's how you played with like four players, there was those like all adapters. Were you able to put memory cards on those adapters? I don't even remember. So what is this to like? More recipes? Oh? More goodies? Yeah. I mean, it's a freebie. Just stolen technology. So yeah, that was just a little vain. Now we gotta do some more dungeons. You can now use the high blend recipe function of the Nito Fusion. So yeah, we have to finish up with that. Oh, well, let me see this for a moment. What does it mean by high blend? I'm really confused about that. Oh, so yeah, you would have thought a godly spirit orb would not make a log. Is it like... I don't even know what that does! It didn't even give me any... What? Okay. We'll, we'll figure out some other time. Uh, we're just gonna bank our stuff. I just do this just in case. I'm gonna get my needle points. My just needle points. Deposit all. I don't really get about my entrance yet. Now we just need to get rid of Kikoro's stuff. Gonna. Anyhow. Bop. Bop. And bop. Right, right, right. No, 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 no. Just bank all this. I should have done this earlier, actually. Oh. Uh, right. So, any more? No, we have the same old, same old. So, which one shall we do? Because I was actually going to go to an, um, all four. But, depends on how fast they go. Huh, we'll see, we'll see. I kind of want to do the workshop. Actually, no, 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 I know which one would be interesting. This one. Underground storage room, because this is also going to probably be one of the more difficult ones, due to RNG. This is an underground storage room inside Bunnyland, where all sorts of items are stored. Various items are sent to the item testing field that is set up here. The items you possess will randomly change every time you go to a different floor. Yeah! That sounds fun. Full RNG. At the mercy of it. Do, 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 do. 
Oh, lordy, lord, lord. So, what items do we have? Whoa! We already have items! Whoa! Level 71 fan! Why do you suck? <laughs> like, you're level 71. Oh, no, I should wreck up that. Oh, that's the accuracy thing. See, do we even get food? Oh, we do. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. Well? That's plus 20, though. Oh, man. So do we even get to keep the random items in the end? I have no clue. Especially took the long way around, by the way. <laughs> this is pretty typical. Why is the fan so bad at level 71? I don't understand. Huh? We should get that too, just in case. So we should eat something before we go to the next floor as well, just in case. Well, we already have too many items. Wowee. No, we don't need that. We don't need that. As soon as we get down on our floor, it's just like, oh. Okay, right, so let's eat something, because we're getting randomized items. Actually, no, you know what else we could do? I don't know if it gives us, like, pretty much a full inventory every time. Is this a pie to when you have full inventory? No. Okay, I was just curious. So we get new items, so what do we have now? Okay, so it's, we get a full inventory just randomly. So we have to work with what we've got, eh? Whoa. That's pretty good. Magic Star Sword. And it also has random stuff as well. Oh, that's a seal? Dang. Oh, we have none of those. Um, ribbon. What's the best shield we've got? What the heck? Why is that so good? Yeah, we'll equip that one's partner. I know it's cursed, but it's really good in comparison. And then we'll give her this. Oh, we got a Rantail too. Interesting. There's a lot of things we've got! Anyhow, let's just get to the honors of what we've got. I think we see a lot of variety of weapon designs as well. That's really neat. I quite like this one, just to be able to preview stuff. <laughs> oh my. This one's not bad though. We have to get the most out of this equipment that's kind of good. Oh. Wait, we don't have enough? Wait, do I have some of waste? I mean, the double thing. Oh, I do! Oh my. There we go. Sure, look at the fine detail, eh? So, we should probably just eat this. I'm gonna see if we can expand our tummy a little bit. Probably don't need to do this, but hey. Here we go. Okay, what do we have now? Robot Viking, what do you have? Insane Burst? Ooh, no. That's an actual thing? Interesting. Equip this. This should be fine. Remy doll. Electro Romilia doll. And then what weapons do we have? Exorcism rod. Oh, there's uh, that actually exists. So we're gonna equip that. <laughs> of course, we get Remy's weapon when Romilia in the random thing. Yeah. 
So I guess we'll give this to Kokoro. Oh, that's um, Suwako's weapon, isn't it? I just made her go insane, didn't I? Uh oh. She's gonna go insane next floor, isn't she? That might be horrible. Uh oh. Well, hopefully it doesn't proc. Oh no, I will proc, won't it? What am I saying? Oh, we could pray, right? Actually, do we have any spell cards? I want to test this. Oh, okay. I have no clue what I did. Maybe I have to be Raymond to use it. No clue. What is saying this doesn't run how passive wise? Just HP and T hover, right? Yeah. Of course, there's another one of these. So, spellcard wise, we have Road to Death Trap. That's pretty much useless. Um, yeah, we've got a lot of useless stuff. We do have a lot of power, though. Should we do a choke point? Yeah, let's do a choke point. This is just safer. Because I don't want to try and speed through this, especially if Kukura ends up going insane the next floor. Although, we, that isn't even the place. Yeah, that doesn't even lead to the next floor. Yeah, we can kind of skim over it now. Got some XP, I guess. It's something? Okay, don't you dare kill me, Kukura. Don't kill. Oh, she's not insane. Okay, because she lost the equipment. Oh, okay, okay. Mega Power God. Whoa, what does this have? This is too handy. This is too handy. What the heck? I want this. How do you get this? Huh. Protection offering. Surrounding effect. <laughs> you can eat yeah, of course. Wasteful. Oh. We have a big potato. You know, I'm going to quote this just to see what looks. That looks cool! What the heck? Anyhow, what is it? That's fine. Partner. Da -da -da -da. What will happen? Her punishment. We'll give her that. How will random the I'm going to stab you now. I didn't even stab him. Just whacked him with it. Whacked him with my pillar. Well, we're already done with that floor. Um, that'll do. Right, okay, what we got now? Raging Tempest only spirit. What the heck does this look like? What do you have? Take right jump and stuff, right? Release, very special one account, level decrease. Ooh. Okay. What is that? That looks really cool. Okay, uh. That's really strong, so we give her that. Mistyus hat. That's nice. What do you have? You'll give her that. This does bad things to us, I believe. Yeah. Why would we even want that? Yes. I mean, what, what, does that have a negative? Nope. That's a really cool weapon. Oh, double speed. Nice. Oh, 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 oh. You give us double speed to catch up to it, then you overkill it anyway, Kokoro. Welcome to Kokoro. Ooh. Nice rage, though. I believe this weapon comes from the unicorn horn, actually. Oh, cars. Oh, actually, it's spell cards? Oh, we can't use that. No, because we ain't Raymond. We have our own variation of it, we just didn't get. Hello, Aya. I done diddly shout with you. Oh, my. So far, we haven't been completely screwed over yet, though. Because maybe there'll be a floor where we have no equipment. I don't want to jinx that, actually. Okay, so there's Yomus, so the first one we want is a shield. Tenshi's Peach Tree. Yeah! That doesn't seem too bad. I just want some defenses so we're going to get blocked by Yomu. Okay, so Soul Slicing Sword. Mermaid Princess's Boots. 
power up, heal, just, yeah, we're getting that. That's awesome, a resonance, though. Uh-oh, 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 oh Ooh. Oh, that was good. Okay, right, so... Yeah, we'll have this on. Now, what do we want to give to Kokoro? That's cursed, and it's kind of meh. We'll give her that. What the heck? And then Soul Slicing Sword, I guess, for now. What the heck? This stuff just looks absolutely ridiculous! Like, I'm literally carrying around a tree as a shield, and a little wakasagi as my weapon! <laughs> no, you hit my kick. <laughs> yeah, that's the point. I mean, you know, what do I have? Oh, only in a clear. Well, this was. <laughs> Don't think we need the healing. Because we have some things to help us against relatively strong enemies. Now, why am I going up? I could go here. Do, 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 do. Oh, well, good thing I didn't land here, right? Next four. Oh. Anyhow, let me see what we've got. Moral Ashes. Reincarnation. Huh? Why do I want that? That could maybe synergize with something. Maybe. I don't know, what, what do we have? Compound Resistance. Yeah. Okay. Chin's Tail. So we don't have that many good things as far as shields go. What the heck, really? <laughs> I actually want that. What are you doing, invincible? Why would you want to be? Why would you want that? Like, I don't want to be invincible. What the? Vestro? Wait, is this Iku's weapon? Like, is that just this? I don't think it is, maybe? You know what, what we got? Hanging hole right all. Oh gosh, I was possessed. What the heck? Okay, sure. This will be nice. My draw pierced the heavens. Oh my gosh. I feel like Mickey Mouse already. Oh, well, that, that, that was short left. I like that shield though. Anyhow. She can oh, we only have one weapon? Oh no. Well, uh. Okay, right. What does this do? Rage tech tolerance. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. Let's go pretty good defense, and then we just give this to Kokoro. What do we have here? Okay. Do we have any medicine then? Yes, we do. <laughs> Oh, some frozen stuff, okay. Okay, I just want to make sure there's stuff in there. Wait, is this what we have? Wait, 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 hold the phone. Did I not pick? Oh, it does! Plus three! Oh, that makes sense because it's good claws. Okay. And you know, it's chain. Which cat punches a bunch. That's, that's a nice touch! Take my kitchen! Honk honk, huh? mother trucker! The chain goes honk! Anyhow! <laughs> Come on, where's the next floor? Oh, I wanted to see more stuff! Oh. Cause that's, that's another thing I did on occasion, like, off screen. I made, well, upgrade some pieces of equipment just to see what it looks like. For example, I have Cassin's Bandages, which looks pretty cool. Got a lot of turbulence there. What the heck? Oh, we can just use this. Let's go out in style. Woo! And then we're in a pad of wound. Okay, no, we're afraid. We're afraid. There's no point doing anything. What did we get? Yeah, answer just go to the next floor. By equipping this thing, out. It's like we're literally at the next floor. Like, bam. No point equipping anything. 
Now there's a point because there's an enemy nearby. Water blade and choco edge. Ooh, this might be amazing. Yep, chocolate sword. Let's go. Okay, special. Hey, that's my shield. Yeah, I've got his horn. Evolved hat of Sawako. I should have read all these. I really should have. I'm, I'm just getting distracted. What? Okay. A great charm. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Wait, why? Why am I burning? Oh gosh, did I not read the fine print? What does this have? Does the weapon have incinerate? Why does incinerate? No, no, seriously. What? What actually has incinerate on me? Is it this? Oh. Pff. Okay. Which is like, oh sure, I'll use that. And it's like, oh. I like that, I like that. That doesn't really matter. What about this? You board Yama's book. I don't know if that even does anything, so let's just go back. Okay, we're not burning now. That that's pretty good. Already an upgrade. Uh oh. My... Oh! We lost a lot of turns due to that Melicani. <laughs> so you could have potentially died. Okay, are we out? We out? We out. That'll do, Dave. That'll do. Any more veins? That'd be nice. That one was alright. Wasn't too exciting, though. No, no. Could have been a absolutely hard. I'm just thinking of what could have potentially happened. Oh no. That could be terrible. It could be an atrocity. So what do we have left for next time? Because I think we have to do a couple more. Like literally a couple more. Should we just do this? We could maybe find one more. Mm. I guess we could do this one. This one will be relatively interesting I think. Yeah, we'll do one more, we'll do one more. Why not? Wait, did we actually get keep those items? No, it's just the money and stuff. I was hopeful, just like, wait, did we get keep it? No, we didn't. That'd be, like, kind of fun. Just like, oh, hey, maybe I could get lucky and get something really good. Okay, we head ahead. One could argue that this was a bit of a retake of the dungeon. And you wouldn't be wrong. Um, pretty much, I got to about 414. And admittedly, with that run, I was getting relatively bored. Holy moly, well, I, I say I was getting relatively bored, and now I don't get bored because a bunch of things just happened, holy moly! But, um, pretty much I was stuck with a shield for the most part. I had the carrot of happiness. I scrounged around a bunch, and there was nothing of excitement. There was no weapons, no nothing. And I did die as a result. I died to a, an Aya, in fact. And a Wakasagi hit me. Um, because all of a sudden, they're just like, oh, we have relatively high damaging enemies at these last couple of floors, which makes sense. I should have expected something along those lines. But, I had no weapons, so what was it to do? I could, I made some refined green tea, but face tank and damage can only get you so far. Um, and I'm not gonna lie, as I said, I got relatively bored because having no weapon and whatnot just was like, hey, I have to slowly punch people to death. <laughs> so I'll take this hula hoop plus two. Ooh, actually. Oh, actually. Now this is, this is pretty exciting. Two hula hoops! Let's go. I mean, come on, look at this. A super fun hoop toy. It's also really popular among girls. Round and round of girls. The day's gonna go around even more than usual. I mean, I can do it with hula hoops. That's already better than the previous run. <laughs> I think I would have edited it out regardless. Even if I managed to do it, well not edit it out, but edit it out to like, near the end. Regardless of what the outcome was. Of that previous run, because it's like, oh yeah, I got there? Well, it would be near the end. Um, if I didn't, well, new run. So I was actually curious whether there was weapons! I was like, well, dude, it was just like, oh, we just use shields. And that's it, like, do you have shields? Yeah, you don't have shields. It's a no kill leaf. Oh, you're sturdy. I wish I still had my carrot of happiness, though. 
So that way I don't need to rely on grinding on these. Because I know Adai is just going to outright bonk me if I don't have a shield on. So, whoa, Smash Mallet? I remember hearing about this weapon. A mallet with an intersecting head and handle. Though it's used for fresh and green, it can also be used for pounding mulch. It does have really nice... Oh my. Oh my, where is it? Now we can give one of these to uh, Kakaro. Bam, bam. It's nice being able to dual wield. Hey, I'm not completely punished for not being away for it. Because I actually have a few. <laughs> We don't have much of the way of food though. Can we make any food actually right now? Oh yeah, we can. Nice. Can we make any more? No, we can't. I'm just going to see if we can turn into big red bean. There we go. Okay, time to bonk things. I hope we get a key of the stuff actually, because I've never had a Smash Mallet. And again, from what I've heard, it's a really good weapon, and looking at its passive, it's got some really nice passives. Although I think it would be more of an early game weapon, if anything. Yeah. That's the point, does he even like target anything good? Or does this forever stay a Smash Mallet? Because I know there's some things that stay w what they are forever. Oh, that's rude. That is so rude! We were so close! There's another thing that happened in that previous one. There was hardly any traps. Um, <laughs> it was literally just me being like, okay, I'm, just, I'm going to spawn next to the next warp point. Oh, this one? Okay, okay, I'll just, I'll just keep going. I guess, wow, there was two gust traps. We have the donation box if everyone wants to use that. And they, they're actually dropping equipment as well! Like, what the heck? That never happened for me on my other run. Was mine like the bootleg dungeon or something? Oh. I'm fine. I really should consider not dual wielding the... I think I... But then again? I mean, having that passive to... No, no, no. I know I can take it. No, I can it. Uh, let me see what this has got here. Do we have anything with float resistance? We can eat from that. Which I think we shall. Yeah, we'll do that. There we go. Not the most exciting thing to watch, I know, but hey, it gets my tummy up. I we're at over the halfway point now. Well, not over. About halfway, but you can't really put 15 into, you know, half. I mean, 7.5 technically. Yeah, you can fight it if you go to take the cow to <laughs> Oh, Kappa! Kappa, Kappa. A pandemonium, though? Huh. Oh, this one's really easy. Wheelbarrow! <gasps> Hang on. That's also the thing that gives regen, right? Nah, nah, nah. We gotta go wheelbarrow, though. That did free damage. I think its thing reduces its damage regardless. So you're like, why there? Yeah, 20%. Aww. Well, just Smash Mala is. So everything's better than Hohip, right? Yeah. We can't fuse, so I guess we'll do this. With this? Sure. Now some goop and a mallet. Noise. As is I regenerate on the next floor, if I'm at relative low health, I get some health back. It's nice. Pairs of it, not so nice, though. Oh. Oh. Got a piece of candy. No! You turned Jen's tail into some food! But I'm actually kind of thankful for food, but that was a pretty good shield that you got rid of. Colored leaf, is that any good? I think it'd be bare. Let me see. 
So we can get these. Well, we won't get regen. But does it get anything? Mm, it doesn't become better now. We'll just upgrade our mallets. Or smash mallet. Give me smash. Well, I was missing a lot. That was unfortunate. <laughs> Gosh. Oh. Uh. Well, of luck. I don't like melancholy. Or melancholy, sorry for the. No! Oh, okay, that's fine. I was gonna say if my, one of my weapons was cursed, I'd be kind of really mad. Especially if it was like one of my other hand weapons. If it was my off hand, I'd be miffed. If it was a smash mail, I don't think I'd be that miffed actually. It's a pretty good weapon. It's pretty much two handed by a one hander of his passives. We're still in the X floor. So I want to see whether we're going to get another event or if it's literally just going to be the last dungeon that we do in the next episode. <laughs> there we go. Oh. This is familiar territory. Bada bing, bada boom. What weapon is this? Pendulum? Uh, it's not pretty good. I don't recall. Let's go free base, so it must be pretty good. Can't really. Oh, we can't fuse that, actually. We'll give that to Kokoro, I think. Yeah, she needs something better. Uh, what charms do we have there? I want that, actually. Actually, no, I don't. I like my little luck, actually. It's the whole tummy stuff. What do we have? Nothing, right? No. Give me that. There we go. Gotta go full mallet. When you smash once, smash twice. Oh. That's why I couldn't move. Well, be no sneaky peeky like that, eh? You little wench. I should not have no clue. Could have been. It could have been a random question. Or it could have just been a ca cap because we got a cucumber. Banana seed. Eh? What can we make right now? Because I need to make sure that we're prepared for subsequent floors. You make one of these. What's, what's that other question mark food, actually? Oh, that'd be grilled, right? Oh, I don't know. Making this, anyhow. Um, oh, I should have saved that. I guess we find a mole trap. Okay, so what else can we make? Can we make any medicine? Yes, we can. So we got some supplies just in case. If we get a little bit screwed over. What's with all these kappas? I had nothing to deserve this. In fact, I don't want you to kind of escape! Okay, I think we're at the difficulty spike now. Could be wrong. Yeah, we're at the difficulty spike because there's Misty Okay. Familiar territory, familiar territory. So there's gonna be eyes and stuff. Aarons! There's Aarons too? Sure. I'm actually much lower level than I was before. This shouldn't be that bad, right? No. Especially if you're Oh yeah, I don't have to let's cut corners. Oh! Convenient! Wait, but there might be a pandemonium. Uh-oh. Okay, no pandemonium. No, I just was wondering what I was doing that. That's a cap. Why did we have to mess? No! 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 Uh... Oh! Uh oh. Uh... Do we have anything for you? Anything for you? Do we have a. Don't one shot me, please. Oh no! Oh my gosh. Oh no. 
thank you, Kikora, for being a great tank right now. Can you not fuse? Can you not? Oh, no, a Yomu! Yo, no, 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 no. You mother trucker. No. What's... Okay, did the Yomu not stalk us? That'd be absolutely fantastic. Rabbit tail? Yeah, don't you do- No, my food! Oh, you. Yeah. Well, we have this thing, yeah. So why, why, why am I reacting to it? But, I'm scared of that Yomu. I just have a feeling I'm gonna go like past the corner and it's gonna be like, Hey there, remember me? You killed my-, my... Uh-oh. I don't like this! Oh, okay, that's just a normal one. There we go. That's what I should have done to it before. Hey, we're out! We're out! Let me out! Actually, wait, before we get... No, that's it. Hang on, that's out. <laughs> Let's go like, oh, we get greedy, but I don't know if I even get to save the stuff. Yeah, it does look like an attraction of the campus would like, indeed. So, any events? Or nah? No, okay. So, that's that. That's that, indeed. Well, well, well! So many old scrap papers do we have? Do we have almost all of them? I would imagine. I don't have no clue what they do, but we're getting them. One. Where are we missing? One. Wait, can we just like sort of? Yeah. Zero. One, two, three. We need four. We need six. We've got eight, we've got nine, we've got ten. Is there up to ten? So we're missing two more. But there's only one dungeon. I guess it's around which one you get? I've never redone one of them. But yeah, next up would be Black Revenger. Hmm. The fact that enemies are equipped might be really interesting to... Hopefully it doesn't RNG murder me, though. <laughs> but that's something that you can always hope for in a roguelike game. It's just like, I hope I don't get screwed over today. <laughs> Oh, I know the people too. Did we keep it? Yeah, we kept it! Ooh, so I'm just gonna check this because I'm sure you're curious too. Um, well, this becomes something good. I am not gonna actually fuse it. Hopefully, I don't misclick because I would be really, really sad. Just to see with levels. Smash. It does become something else. Oh! That is something to consider. But then again, I mean, the other passes I've got like hit eight times. I can also sort out my other weapon, or resort the multi-hit seal on um, Kikoro's weapon off screen as well. So we're going to deposit all for now, because obviously, next up, we're going to have to store stuff anyhow. Um, anyhow, folks, thank you all for watching this episode of Two Against a Wanderer. This was going to be a bit more of an edited one, of course. There's going to be quite a bit of editing, because holy moly, this episode would exceed an hour otherwise. But anyhow, ta-ta for now. But I guess the sheer quantity was just like, oh hey, you did this. I just did this. Oh, I found him there. Yeah, so we get a lot of stuff. We get Rokankins as well. Another reason to use Momichi right now as well is to try and stock up on more of her spell cards. Because I don't have many of them because you can't use Fantasy Seal with Momiji. Which is rather unfortunate because if you want to play as Momiji, you pretty much have to farm the spell cards because I've never been able to buy them. We're actually finding tougher things now. I think that's good. I was just kind of skimming over the floors because we've got good enough equipment to tank a lot of things. Do, 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 do. At least for now, I don't know if there's going to be anything substantially more difficult. Like maybe I'll get one shot by this Yoshika san I don't know. I haven't personally tested it. I normally don't, don't speed through these type of dungeons. Do, 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 do. But I'm more interested about the uh, dungeons that have no items. I could have done this off screen. Good off. Good off. But I wanted to see whether or not we'll get events soon enough. So we're just gonna slap all these little ghosties. Say ain't spooking me, I ain't afraid of no ghosts. Wait, Vengeful Spirits? That was in a boss fight, wasn't it? That was something in the early... The, the first one, right? Well, not, it wasn't even really a... Well, it was a boss fight, it was just scripted. Yeah, the Renoski one. 
Was there any other places of interest, Paris? I know you get to talk to them in the old capital, but I don't remember ever getting to fight them. Oh, trap trap. That's very interesting, though. We get to fight a sheer quantity of varieties of ghosts. Oh my gosh, all these trap traps. Oh, I want the uncanny shine. Those are very useful. Uh, what? Because they're very useful for things like pandemoniums and boss fights. Uh, I, so let's just use it. I just love what he's done, Maku, as well. It's so cool. It's more my style. But yeah, you know, uh, I can restrain really stuff as like, eh. I, I use fantasy seals and stuff, like goalie balls, but then I let you just cleave you. It's, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool indeed. I don't know. I feel like it's a. Momiji is just a little bit more flashy for me. Never against Rainbow, of course. I really like her as the character. Ooh. One of my faves, of course. One of my faves. <laughs> I mean, Hexer was flashy enough in Urban Legend and Limbo when I was playing as her. Holy moly. Zip zap zopping all over the shop. Oh, the Chico Sen. Let's go. Toasted waffle. Let's eat that. Why not? This seems like a pretty good dungeon for farming various items, too. Oh, Yuko Sama. Well, I ain't afraid of no ghost. Okay, let's see how much this heals. Is that. Well, I don't know. Nine. Let me see. Yeah, I don't think we get 11 hats. I think we just get eight. So those don't stack. Okay, stay yeah, alert. We've got Big Yuko in our hands. Okay. That's not that worrisome. And then she hit for two. Eh! <laughs> I'm worried about Big Yuko. Uh, I didn't like no damage. Vengeful Spirit Sun. Wait, there's Tears of Vengeful Spirits? What the heck? Okay. Never thought that would have been a thing. Vengeful Spirit Sun. Fun like, oh, that's a gun. Oh, it's like a banky head, Sam. Yeah, we're gonna have to put that seal back in Kokoro's weapon because it, it looks like it doesn't work. Oh, yeah, that could actually completely screw you over like relatively easily. Now that I think about it, because imagine if, you've, if you're here with like suboptimal equipment. Or decent equipment on her face, that. And then you just get completely wrecked by, like, a Sam or something. Just because there was half phantoms. So I can definitely understand how this one could be difficult. Arco is just good enough. Team around, we tackle a big Yuko that came out of nowhere. Although, it could have been something much worse. If it was a big Yoma, I think we would have died. Yeah, I think if it was a big Yoma, we would actually just get, like, one shot. So, like, that, that, that one. They can also decrease their power, so that's probably another reason why. That's just part of her setup. Alright, so uh, 12th floor. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Whoa, yeah, yeah. She's not a ghost, is she? <laughs> Let's just say anything spooky, yeah. I suppose. Oh, I just saw there was a Yomusama. That might be really scary. Hopefully, she doesn't get become bag. Actually, what's the spell card? Un yeah, if we could farm on Kani Shines here, that's great. Definitely one of my favorite spell cards to use in this game. It can be a bit of a problem at times, however, but it's mostly helpful. There it was. <gasps> yeah, if that was big, that could have one shot us. Before we were leveled up, anyhow. Finally, the sands aren't that strong, though. Having that heal does help out a lot as well. Lurk is salmon. No good if they're tough. I haven't really fought many of them. Better yeah. spare, hello, bye bye. Having Cass in here would be so appropriate. Another Uncanny Shine, give me that. Um, doo -doo -doo. Can you even buy Uncanny Shines anywhere? I think you can at times, but not like too often. Oh, it's a Jiggle Sama. I do wish Kokoro was a bit more tank here of a character because I could use her to tank some of them. A little mole trap, that's unfortunate. Oh. 
We don't have the thing that lets me attack through walls in. I do, right? Meh. Probably just weft the Dan Marker. Maybe I'm just used to Ramers. Ooh. There's a lot of gaps. If I had a bunch of money, then I'd actually purchase them. I wonder if I could actually possess Mamizo or something. I've tried several times to be able to, to like, defeat her, and I have not managed it yet. Oh, Kogus or something. That's not that scary, I imagine. What's she gonna do? Spook me? Speaking of which, hello, bye bye. Oh. You're a little bit annoying. There we go. Okay, right. 10,000. What the heck? Never had that. Currency used at the Dream and Magic Theme Park, Nazarene Land. Rumor has it that people burn this to see their feet amidst all the darkness. So. Disneyland? Anyhow. I don't want this. Welp. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, come on, there we go. We're almost done, we're almost done. Oh! Well, that's convenient. Then we just need to go through one more. Pandemonium, that's fine, because since we've got a bunch of these, we could probably just use this and be done with it. I didn't want to save them, but I mean, there's that many enemies, so why not just get rid of them all, right? And then just bail. I could check the loot, but. I've got plenty, I've got plenty. Clear Tony Dallas from a parental perspective, that wasn't scary at all. Oh no, because more, most of the total characters are cute than scary. Oh, now we have an event! Okay, fine! About <laughs> dang time! I can't believe I was one off! Ah, convenient! Yeah. Sometimes I get a bit miffed at some of the dungeons, but it's okay. It's a roguelike experience, I can't really blame it. Are you talking on the phone or something, or a walkie talkie? That's what I'm curious about. これは哀れみの表情。他の玉徒たちと連絡を取り合っていたんです。一人で話をしていたわけじゃありません。Oh, that works, yeah. I should forgot they could do that. そういえば、玉徒同士ってどんなに離れていてもリアルタイムで会話ができるんだっけ? So you can talk to your little buddy on Earth? PMs? That'd be convenient! Who needs a phone anymore? Well, we already have one, which is Kukoro, but who else? Well, I got upload somehow. Hmm. <laughs> Why would Rainbow use a computer in the first place? Yeah. How did they even get to the moon? Then again, how did Kokoro get to the moon? Will these questions ever get answered? I'll never know. It's Toho! Welcome to Kinsokyo! <laughs> Wait, is it Koishi? No, 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 no,
That would be like the main character thinking about, but no, 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 no. I mean, even it's so forgot about her. She's not in this game we're talking about. Psh, it's quite she again. And she's gone. Oh, do you say so? Huh? Or was it Kokoro? Oh, oh? Oh, it was a Kappa cloaking device! <laughs> I mean, that could have been also a possible to put. Oh, no, Koishi! Dang it! Dang that, but. Raymond's experience in yokai extermination. やっぱり君はすごいな。伊達に白霊の巫女をやっているわけじゃないんだね。私はね、余計なごたごたには巻き込まれたくないの。that would be preferable. We try to steal some lunar technology. What was she even doing on that PC? For now. Uh? No, yeah, we gold digger. I just love Kakora's background. Hello, and welcome back to some more to Against the Wanderer. On our last episode, we viewed a few events at the Yokai Village and Old Capital of Utsu Ryuji. That was just to break the mold a little bit, because otherwise it would just be more dungeons than the Wutatsuki Bunny Line all in a row. Now, speaking on that, whilst we're on that topic, I did do some of them off screen, mainly because I, I did them. I initially recorded them. And a few of them weren't that interesting, like this one was just kind of meh, this one was just kind of a lengthy endeavor with no equipment and whatnot. I mean, I have a feeling you could get equipment, but I never got any. Um, this one was relatively frustrating. Very much in short, you only have talismans. If you don't get flame or thunder talisman, you may as well be stuffed. Um, now, some of the other ones admittedly aren't the most interesting, but I don't know when there's going to be an event. Worst comes to worst, we do a little bit of editing. Because there was no events last time I did these dungeons either. Else I would have just had it all shown in. But we're going to do the haunted house first. Because I believe that's the only one that allows items, right? Yeah. Of the remainder. It's pretty much similar to one that we've done before. Um, which was the animal one. We may as well do this one on screen. Because I actually want to show off my upgraded equipment. Because it's pretty good. It's pretty good. It's still the same, obviously, in look. But it's quite substantially stronger. At least I think it is. It should be, it should be. Anyway, a scary, surprising, and funny haunted house is a must for any theme park. Bunny Land is a unique but standard haunted house. In this dungeon, ghosts like enemies will appear in a haunted house. If you prepare the right equipment, you'll have no problem with it. Well, we probably won't have a problem with it regardless. I haven't brought that many supplies either because I have a feeling this is going to be somewhere to the animal one. The animal lunanet. So we shall see indeed. Because I mostly just want to be done with all of these dungeons. Because normally it's a lot easier to include a lot of things because, you know... The main story dungeon normally has like a half, no, two tidbits to it, that's what I was going to say. Like for example, with the Yokai Village, we did a bit of dungeon, we went to Yokai Village. 
and then we did a better dungeon, we were at Notori. And then we did a better dungeon, and then we're at the boss. And it's a similar format for the old capital area. Or the underground area, let me rephrase that. And I thought that was kind of cool. I do like the different um, feeling of this, but it's just like, yeah. At the same time, some of the dungeons are just kind of there to me. Still nice that there's a quantity, though. Then again, my generation was pretty bad, like getting mold deep. <laughs> Red bead cakes on the first floor. Oh, that was pretty horrible. That, that, that was indeed pretty horrible, Tabs. Because in the task one, there was rarely any food for me as well. There could be food, but sometimes it just isn't. Now, I've also got 11 hits on this weapon now, because I decided to just try the seal on this to see if it works. I actually don't know if I can count that, because it goes by so quickly. But yeah, I put my level attack here, I believe. Yeah. I don't know if this stacks. I hope it does. If it doesn't, then we just need to put back with Kokoros. I wish there was a way for me to test it as a present. Because I fear since I've got a lifesteal thing. Well, not even a lifesteal. It's just like I had and I heal. Um, well, one could argue that's lifesteal. But it's just need for the full thing like Vampire. Maybe I could test if I'm missing 11 health, though. Can you, can you do damage to me? No, you don't do damage to me at all. Like, ever. Because of my equipment. Maybe I should have just unequipped something. If only there was healing in the log, then I'd be able to tell whether or not I should put the seal back into Kokoro's weapon. Because I'd hope it would stack. I know I was originally going to keep on her weapon, it's just I put it on this so then I could tank a little bit better. Oh, that was a gap trap. That could be bad. <sighs> okay, actually, yeah, can you like me a few times? Like me again. No, Kakara! Dang it. I just wanted to lose 11 HP. Ooh. That was unfortunate there. Should be able to speed through this one relatively quick. Why did Kasumi level up? I have no clue. Um, right, so we want to level up Kikoro's equipment a little bit. Well, drink a buff would be nice. Anyhow, so we want to unequip her blade. I didn't find many odds and statues in the place that I grinded. I had something anyway. So we got plus 59. Oh, that is really good, actually. Because I've heard it amazing max this out. The limit was 108, and then I randomly was able to get it to 109. The limit's now 112. It's a bit ridiculous. That's mainly due to one of the seals that they've got in it that increases the limit. I actually want to test to see whether or not you lose your bonuses if you unequip that seal. Because what I was originally going to do at some point in time is when I get each of these to, like, say, 80 limit, and then I just um, unequip the seal after I get to, like, over 100, then put on another thing, get that thing to over 100, and try that again. I was going to try that, but that was going to take a while. Oh, that's why this is going to be kind of scary. Okay, so there's half phantoms that possess things. That's how it leveled it up. I wasn't paying full attention. We should be fine, though. There's also Seki Banky heads. Oh, this, so this is a bit more interesting than the Lunanette because we get to see some of them, like, separated and whatnot. We might be able to get screwed over, though. Who knows? Because before it was just, like, ear types, and that was that. Uh, oh, a new preserve guy. Fine with that. Again, I'm gonna try and speed for it. I'm gonna try and speed for it, because I don't know whether or not there will be an event. I have wanted to play, play Momiji for a while as well, again. Because we've been. Oh, I don't want that. Because we've been Raymond for so long. I've been Momiji a couple of times off screen, however. I was just like, yeah, why not use her a little bit in the main story? Because after when we finish the main story, assuming it's going to come to a close, because who knows when it will, um, there's always the DLC ones as well, isn't there? Where we play as different characters. Which I'm very much looking forward to. Lyrica Seam. Yep, but that half time was just possessing a bunch of people. Wait, did we all. Oh, I was. I'm literally just on autopilot right now. <laughs> Doing a bunch of dungeons in a row kind of does that to you. It's just like, oh, okay, good to do this. <laughs> Nothing against, of course. She's just been farming quite a bit. Quite a bit. You know, I actually looked at my playtime on this game as well, and I actually fired a lot more hours than what I saw. I only had like 40 hours or so, and it felt like as if I spent a lot more. I quite like this one, just to be able to preview stuff.
Oh my. This one's not bad though. We have to get the most out of this equipment is kind of good. Oh. Wait, we don't have enough? Wait, do I have some of waste? I mean, the double thing. Oh, yeah, I do, do I? Oh, I do! Oh, my. There we go. Sure, look to the fine detail, eh? So, we should probably just eat this. We can see if we can explain our tummy a little bit. Probably don't need to do this, but hey, here we go. Okay, what do we have now? Robot Viking, what do you have? Insane Burst? Ooh, no. That's an actual thing? Interesting. Huh. I'll equip this. This should be fine. Remy doll. Electro Romilia doll. And then what weapons do we have? Exorcism rod. Oh! There's, uh, that actually exists. So we're going to equip that. <laughs> of course we get Raymond's weapon when Rumble meets you in the random thing, eh? So I guess we'll give this to Kokoro. Oh, that's um, Suwako's weapon, isn't it? I just made her go insane, didn't I? Uh-oh! She's going to go insane next floor, isn't she? That might be horrible. Uh -oh. Well, hopefully it doesn't proc. Oh no, I will proc, won't it? What am I saying? Oh, well, we could pray, right? Actually, do I have any spell cards? I want to test this. Oh, okay. I have no clue what I did. Maybe I have to be Raymond to use it. No clue. Should we just say this doesn't really have passive wise? Just HP and T over here. Of course, there's another one of these. So, spellcard wise, we have Road to Death Trap. That's pretty much useless. Um, yeah, we've got a lot of useless stuff. We do have a lot of power, though. Should we do a choke point? Yeah, let's do a choke point. This is just safer. Because I don't want to try and speed through this, especially if Kukura ends up going insane the next floor. Although, we, that is not even the place. Yeah, that doesn't even lead to the next floor. I think we can kind of skim over it now. Cost a lot of XP, I guess. It's something? Okay, don't you dare kill me, Kukura. Don't kill. Oh, she's not insane. Okay, because she lost the equipment. Oh, okay, okay. Mega Power God. Whoa, what does this have? This is two handed. This is two handed. What the heck? I want this. How do you get this? Huh. Protection offering. Surrounding effect. <laughs> you can eat it, of course. Wasteful. Oh. We have a big potato. You know, I'm going to quote this just to see what looks. That looks cool! What the heck? Anyhow, what is That's fine. Partner. Da -da -da -da. What will happen? Grand punishment. We'll give her that. Hello, random Natori. I'm going to stab you now. I didn't even stab him. Just whacked him with it. Whacked him with my pillow. Well, we're already done with that floor. Um, now do. Right, okay, what we got now? Raging Tempest only spirit. What the heck does this look like? What do you have? Take range up and stuff, right? Release, very special one account. Level decrease. Ooh. 
Okay. Let me use that. That looks really cool. Okay, uh... That's really strong, so we give her that. Misty as hat. That's nice. What do you have? You'll give her that. This does bad things to us, I believe. Yeah. Why would we even want that? Yes. I mean, what, what, does that have a negative? Nope. That's a really cool weapon. Oh, double speed. Nice. Oh, 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 oh. You give us double speed to catch up to the you overkill Ada with Kokoro. Welcome to Kokoro. Nice rage, though. I believe this weapon comes from the unicorn horn, actually. Oh, cars. Oh, actually, it's spell cards? Well, we can't use that. No, because we ain't Raymu. We have our own variation of it, we just can get. Hello, Aya. I done diddly shout you. Oh my. So far, we haven't been completely screwed over yet, though. Because maybe there'll be a floor where we have no equipment. I don't want to jinx that, actually. Okay, so there's Yomus, so the first one we want is a shield. Tenshi's Peach Tree. Yeah! That doesn't seem too bad. I just want some defenses we're going to get blocked by Yomu. Okay, so Soul Slicing Sword. Mermaid Princess's Boots. How commentary. ここのコンピューターをコストリッチ買わせてもらってね。少しだけど、月の技術を解析することに成功したな。うん、あ、お。そのデータを使って、ミトフュージョンをパワーアップさせてあげるよ。Sure, Wait, we have slot free? Are we the PS2 or something? There were those adapters for the PS2, right? Oh man, it's been so long. I know that's how you played with like four players, there was those like all adapters. Were you able to put memory cards in those adapters? I don't even remember. So what is this still like? More recipes? Oh? Mo goodies. なんだかな。ま、使えるものはありがたく使わせてもらいましょうか。Yeah. I mean, it's a freebie. Just stolen technology. So yeah, that was just a little of pain. Now we got to do some more dungeons. You can now use the high blend recipe function of the Nito Fusion. So yeah, we have to finish up with that. Oh, well, let me see this for a moment. What does it mean by high blend? I'm really confused about that. Oh, so yeah, you would have thought a godly spirit orb would not make a log. Is it like... I don't even know what that does! It didn't even give me any... What? Okay, we'll, we'll figure out some other time. Uh, we're just gonna bank our stuff. I just do this just in case. I'm gonna get my Nito points, my Nito points. Deposit all. I don't really care about my entrance yet. Now we just need to get rid of Kakoto's stuff. Kana. Anyhow. Bop. Bop. And bop. Right, right, right. No, 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 no. 
Just bank all this. I should have done this earlier, actually. Oh. Right. So anymore? No, we have the same old, same old. So which one shall we do? Because I was actually going to go on um, all four. But it depends on how fast they go. Huh, we'll see, we'll see. I kind of want to do the workshop. Actually, no, no, no. I know which one would be interesting. This one. Underground storage room, because this is also going to probably be one of the more difficult ones, due to RNG. This is an underground storage room inside Bunny Island, where all sorts of items are stored. Various items are sent to the item testing field that is set up here. The items you possess will randomly change every time you go to a different floor. Yeah, that sounds fun. Full RNG. At the mercy of it. <laughs> oh lordy lord lord so why do we have whoa we already have I have whoa level 71 fan why do you suck <laughs> like you're level 71 oh no I should look up that Oh, that's the accuracy thing. See, do we even get food? Oh, we do. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. Well. That's plus 20, though. Oh, man. So, do we even get to keep the random items in the end? I have no clue. Of course, we took the long way around, by the way. <laughs> this is pretty typical. Why is the fan so bad at level 71? I don't understand. Huh? I we should get that too, just in case. So we should eat something before we go to the next floor as well, just in case. Well, we already have too many items. Wowee. No, we don't need that. We don't need that. As soon as we get to another floor, it's just like, oh. Okay, right, so let's eat something, so we can randomized items. Actually, no, you know what else we could do? I don't know if it gives us, like, pretty much a full inventory every time. Is this a pie to when you have full inventory? No. Okay, I was just curious. So we get new items, so what do we have now? Okay, so it's, we get a full inventory just randomly. Right, so we have to work with what we've got, eh? Whoa. That's pretty good. Magic Star Sword. And it also has random stuff as well. Well, that's a seal! Dang! Oh, we have none of those. Um, ribbon. What's the best shield we've got? What the heck? Why is that so good? Yeah, we'll equip that with the partner. I know it's cursed, but it's really good in comparison. And then we'll give her this. Oh, we got a ran tail too. Interesting. There's a lot of things we've got! Anyhow, let's just get to the honors of what we've got. At least we can see a lot of variety of weapon designs as well. That's really 